Hey guys, how do I help here? Welcome back to the channel. Now, I wanted to get on here quickly, sort of share some information with you guys. If you're running iOS 17 Developer Beta 4, Apple has re-released this update today. iOS 17 Developer Beta 4, the revised version, is about 300 to 400 megabytes. Now, I'll explain why Apple has released this latest revised version of iOS 17 Developer Beta 4 here in just a few seconds. But aside from that, Apple also today released iPad iPadOS 17 Developer Beta 4 revised as well, and macOS 14 Developer Beta 4 revised is now available for the Mac. Now, last week on July 25th, Apple released iOS 17 Developer Beta 4, but as I mentioned, the revised version is available today with a new build number. The new build number is 21A5291J in comparison to last week's build number, which is of course 21A5291A. H. So the letter towards the end from H to J, and that is what's different today in regards to iOS 17 Developer Beta 4, which by the way, again, it is available for developers as of right now. But why would Apple release a revised version of iOS 17 Developer Beta 4? Well, the reason for that is because Apple has finally also released iOS 17 public beta 2 so the public beta 2 for ios 17 is now currently available so if you're running ios 17 public beta on your device the second beta is now available for you to download now this second beta for the public is the same beta as today's ios 17 developer beta 4 the revised release today simply matching the beta for the public now it's kind of interesting because Typically, when Apple releases a new developer beta, so last week we saw developer beta 4 on the 25th of July, a day or two later they release a second beta for the public. But that did not happen today for public beta testers. It came out on July the 31st, so they sort of forced Apple to have a re-release of beta 4 for developers and the second beta for the public. And hopefully that makes sense, but I just wanted to make sure that you guys were aware. Public beta testers, as of right now, the second beta is available for you, so you can go ahead and download it right now. And developers, the fourth beta for you is available, and you can download it as of right now, but both betas are the exact same software, so everything I covered in regards to new features and changes are now available for registered developers and public beta testers alike. And I just wanted to make you guys aware of that, so just minor updates today in regards to size and build number just simply making everything unified from here on out we should see additional beta starting to roll out maybe on a weekly basis so maybe the developer beta 5 and public beta 3 will most likely become available on the week of the 7th of august so 7th or 8th of august we'll see the next beta for developers beta 5 and for the public beta 3 which basically is the same thing it's just different numbers because of the time of its release and there you guys have it just wanted to make you guys aware of that i hope you guys have a great day and i'll see you guys on the next one peace